This is a CBS 4 News update. Good morning, I'm Maribel Rodriguez. One person is dead this morning after a trooper involved shooting at the Golden Glades Park and Ride. According to investigators, at around 7.30 last night, a trooper was engaged in a traffic stop. Then there was some sort of confrontation. The trooper opened fire and killed the driver. A school bus driver and a bus aide are in the hospital after getting hurt in an accident. Miami PD says a bus driver collided with a car, hit a light pole, and then part of a house on 25th Street and Southwest 34th Avenue. Several homes were without power because of the crash. Ten students were on the bus at the time, but they were not hurt. As for the driver and the aide, they are expected to be okay. Now to campaign 2020. Former Vice President Joe Biden is hinting he could be closer to announcing a presidential run. He appeared before the International Association of Firefighters yesterday in Washington, D.C. Listen to how he reacted after being greeted with cheers of support. I appreciate the energy you showed when I got up here. Um, uh, save it a little longer. I may need it in a few weeks. The former senator from Delaware addressed a gathering crowd with a message of unity. Biden has been the biggest name recognition in the race so far, having served under former President Barack Obama. He already leads several polls among likely Democratic voters for the 2020 primary elections, including a Monmouth University poll released on Monday. Now, CBS4 weather with meteorologist Lisette Gonzalez. Happy Wednesday. It is a lovely view here, Lauderdale by the Sea, from our wind jammer Zerk camera, Lauderdale by the Sea. But we are dealing with that breeze and a mild start 74 in Miami, 75, and for Lauderdale, 76 in Key West. Good news is for now, Broward and Dade quiet after some showers earlier. Still dealing with some rain in spots across the Ever Keys. The wind, though, is a big story today, as already increasing 13, 17 miles an hour out of the east northeast the high today not as hot as yesterday 80 degrees we'll see the chance for passing showers gusty winds at times leading to hazardous marine conditions so a small craft should exercise caution as winds are going to be increasing 15 to 20 knots seas building four to six choppy conditions on the bays as well as a moderate risk of rip currents so that's a heads up for you beachgoers spring breakers in town uh, we're going to see winds gusting over 20 miles an hour and some showers could blow in on the breeze tonight lower on 70 and still the chance for spotty showers tomorrow more of the same not as hot seasonal temperatures and breezy warming up though as we head into the weekend close to the mid 80s as we get into friday saturday and a better chance of rain especially by sunday on st patrick's st maribel I said thanks, and that's the news for now. You can always find us on CBSMiami.com and tune into CBS4 News at 5, 6, 7, and 11 for all of today's important headlines.